peace and love everyone happy new year welcome to 2021 we have arrived congratulations i know 2020 was a crazy yet beautifully chaotic year for people all over the globe yet it was still a beautiful year and many of you are excited that the year is over we are going to see to it and make sure that 2021 is going to be the best year that any of us have yet to see so far claim that see it visualize it believe it manifest it and know that it is already done i say so welcome to blue fire tv guys i am blue and today we're going to be having another paint session our first paint session of 2020 which is going to be a really dope art pour so just stay tuned keep watching i'm just going to be chatting you know yeah just chatting i don't know what i'm gonna be talking about yet but i'm just gonna go with the flow we're gonna have fun this year switch it up a bit do things a little different so as you guys can see i've already done pretty much missed the entire beginning of the video uh but you guys pretty much can just like watch what i'm doing i don't feel like i really have to necessarily explain so much i will have other videos coming this year where i will dive in more to really teach you guys and show you guys step by step what i am doing but this one ain't it i'ma just let y'all yeah Th this one ain't it we just having fun just a little trial and error here and yeah so make sure you guys are subscribed like this video comment down below and click that notification bell so you guys will stay up to date with all of my latest content look it's 2021 i am fired up this year we're coming to you guys with something on a whole another level okay my flame is burning hotter than it has ever burned before i hope you feel the heat i hope you are fired up for your journey this year too and whatever you have going on within your specific life journey i'm sending you much love healing prosperity abundance everything i'm sending you all the energy right now on your journey i love you guys so much um like i said you know 2020 was a beautifully chaotic year for people all over the world, people all over the globe were affected by this pandemic. It was something that touched each and every soul. Even if it touched all of us in different ways, every and each one of us were impacted by it somehow. Um, 2020 for me, you know, I had a lot of major shifts happen in my life. And honestly, it wasn't necessarily the pandemic that caused the shifts that were in my life. It was just the time and the path that I was on and the lessons that I needed to learn and things I needed to heal from uh, to be the cause of what I went through in 2020. I had a lot of beginnings and endings in 21, a lot of deaths, a lot of rebirths in 2021. Shoot, in 2020. Look, do y'all hear me? Do y'all hear me saying in 2020 because I'm in 20, I'm living in the present. I'm not living in the past. There is no such thing as the past. Living in the present. The only thing that is is the now the power of now oh by the way go purchase that book the power of now was one of my favorite books of all time it is always the number one book that i recommend to people the power of now by eckhart Tolle. he is one of my favorite favorite beings in this realm at this very moment he is an amazing a beautiful soul you are too but i'm referring to him at this moment uh he is beautiful please definitely go get that book the power of now it is so inspirational and it brings so much clarity on so many levels i read the book about three times i'm on my fourth read currently and that's why i tell people you have to read something like this read books multiple times don't just read a book one time and think that okay i read a book one time i got all the information nope because what you can get out of it the next time is something that you may not even have thought about the first time and then the third time and the fourth and fifth time if you decide to go that far you still can learn every time you read the book but yeah so that's enough about Eckhart Tolle you know he's not paying or anything I just wanted to give him his credit so yeah I just want people to understand that perspective is everything you know uh, we can go saying that oh my gosh 2020 was a horrible year and honestly people say that every year everybody says that this the next new year is going to be a better year for them 
and then something happens and they're like oh my gosh this year sucks or this year is starting off terribly but it's all your perspective it's all how you think of it it's all what you do with the things that are happening in your life pain is power guys there is no good there is no evil there is just what is and how you look at it what you learn from it you move on and you look at everything as a gift 2020 was a gift i'm 2020 was a gift and if you aren't able to see that you have to dig in you have to dive deep inwards within your own self and find out how 2020 was a gift for you you know what i want you guys to comment down below comment down below how 2020 was a gift for you and if you feel that 2020 was not a gift for you you know what we're going to go ahead and open up the comments for feedback go ahead and write how 2020 was not a good year for you and you know what maybe someone can help you get it together we're not going to have any negativity no slandering no rudeness because you will be removed i'm just going to go ahead and say that on the actual video itself because i don't play that over here okay this is free speech you can actually have free speech here but we're going to do it in a respectful way all right we just want to make sure that we are spreading only positivity love and peace to our fellow beings okay nothing but love and positivity sometimes people have a hard time seeing the light or the gift within their situation or even within themselves and we just want to be here to just help push and to help open people's eyes and to understand that 2020 or whatever you're going through life any situation no matter how high or low it may seem it is all a gift it's just all in your perspective so i love you guys and i appreciate you guys so so very much thank you guys for watching this video as you can see i am pretty much you know what no i'm not done this is supposed to be the final product but in the art world and when you're in the creative space sometimes things just happen and things have to change yet be like water be able to mold be flexible be able to bend and be able to change be able to adapt to change so that's what i had to do okay that's what i had to do um so yeah just stay tuned and you will see the outcome and the finished product of what actually ended up happening to this painting but anyway my favorite part of this entire painting is the eye in the middle um if you guys follow my art make sure you follow me on instagram at all about blue underscore but you will see that i am obsessed with consciousness i'm obsessed with the eye the third eye and i really love this eye in the middle it's like a dragon's eye you know naga shit if you know about nagas hey fam where y'all at i know y'all fired up i know y'all feel the feet i know y'all i said i feel the feet i know y'all feel the heat we are fired up i'm so fired up i can barely even talk um but yes yeah, so as y'all can see that's a bit y'all can see a little bit of the changes right there i added some glitter um just to spice it up and just to kind of see i just wanted to do something extra uh do i love it eh, i feel like i could have lived without the glitter but hey you live and you learn and it still is a dope piece so thank you guys so much for watching stay tuned for more videos to come make sure you are subscribed you like this video comment down below and don't forget comment what or how 2020 was a gift for you down below click that notification bell to stay up to date with all of the latest content i had coming for you guys this year i really hope you guys enjoyed this video thank you guys for staying with me as i talk all my blue stuff um and yeah have a beautiful day i love you